Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, I don't even know which one I wanna do first. I'm actually trying to film two videos in one. So let's just go ahead and do a haul. I didn't stick to my no buy 100%. I guess my other friend Jackie from Jackie Naturals likes to call it low buy. So I was definitely on a low buy for a good two months. I was collecting little items here and there that I bought, but now I've collected enough items and I'm ready to show them to you. So know Ulta's 21 days of beauty beauty is ongoing right now I've made two videos out of it so I've shopped quite a few things and some of them haven't arrived in the mail so I'm just gonna show you what I got in the mail right now and then I will show you part two of this video which is the other items that I bought from different places you know like the boxy Ch boxy charm sales or FabFitFun add-ons or from Sephora or Ulta. Honestly, I can't remember where I got them, but definitely I got them for a good deal. Let's go ahead and start with my Ulta haul. I did give you guys like four weeks in advance notice about the Ulta sale. So if you haven't seen those two videos that I created, please go check it out. It's a good deal. And if anything, you'll know what to buy on the next sale. So the first thing here in my Ulta bag is the Elemis Superfood Facial Oil. I've had these items for a couple of weeks now. I've used them, okay? I put them back in the box, but I've used them for a couple of weeks, days. I've tried this oil, Elemis Oil, I wanna say at least three times already. And let me show you how it looks like. It's oily, you know, I gotta say. It's, it's oily, it's very liquidy. I probably shouldn't have started with oils. Dang it. Now I won't be able to open all the other items that I want to open. Okay. Smart, Terry. <laughs> and I got this because I wanted to start getting into oils. It contains broccoli, flaxseed, daikon, radish. It nourishes, hydrates, and smooths the skin. So I've only used it two or three times, I believe. It hasn't given me acne or anything, but... I have to say that I kind of can't stand the smell. I mean, it's like broccoli juice. That's the smell. It's like rotten broccoli juice. <laughs> Sorry, Elemis, but sometimes there's a price to pay for beauty. So, you know, we just gotta go with it. Before we go on, by the way, I wanna mention that this is kind of like a mini collaboration with Vanessa Beauty. If you haven't seen her channel, she went ham on the Ulta sale and she had gone to the store like almost every single day and it's all over her Instagram. She's a good friend of mine. Check out her haul. She is planning week two of the Ulta sale and everything that she's hauled from Ulta. Her and I bought pretty much entirely different things. So you're definitely going to get a show for a variety of items. So check her out, go to her channel, and see what she got from the Ulta sale. All right, back to the Ulta sale. I went ahead and bought the Clinique Quick Liner for Eyes Intense in Midnight Black. I think that's a color. Intense Midnight. So this is kind of like a blue color. It's a very deep, deep blue. You can't even tell that it's blue anymore. Um, but when it hits the light, it looks really beautiful. There it is. There it is. So I hope you guys can see that. It's very creamy. I've tried it on, of course. And I bought this because it's one of the cruelty-free vegan makeup and I'm planning to do a full face of cruelty-free and or vegan makeup for you guys so I can't wait stay tuned for that video the next item that I bought from the Ulta haul is this flower powder from Beauty Bakery if you guys haven't heard of this brand Beauty Bakery is kind of like bakery inspired or food inspired makeup so their packaging and the names of the makeup that they sell are all kind of food related so in this case i wanted to try i had to try their flower powder and it's their loose setting powder in translucent oh my gosh 
opened it already but it came in perfect packaging i love that it has the sifter so when you travel you can kind of twist and it's going to close that those holes for you so they don't just explode and be all over the place like right now <laughs> I've used it every single day since I've had it and I am loving it so far. So next one are eyelashes. Faux Lily eyelashes. I wanted to show this off on my eyes today and it didn't work out. I look like a drag queen. Not that there's anything wrong with that, but that's not the look that I was going for. It's just not me. The lashes, the lash shape, I tried to trim them. I've cut them both ways to fit my eyes and it just didn't work. I thought I could handle bigger lashes, but no. Lashes I'm wearing right now are from Ardell. Very light, just natural eyelashes and they're just perfect. They look like my real eyelashes, but better. So <laughs> you can't go wrong with that. So these are going back, unfortunately. The next item that I hauled from the Ulta sale was the Cover FX Blush Duo. It's called Monochromatic Blush Duo Matte Plus Shimmer Blush. You know, the only thing I don't like is this packaging. It gets dirty really easily. Yeah, it used to be like really white, and now I can't even remove the makeup stains on them. But it'll probably come off with a makeup remover wipes. I just used a regular wet wipes and it's not working. Here's what it looks like. And I have the color Mojave Mauve. Mojave Mauve. So that's the matte shadow. And then this shimmery one right here. Okay, I digged into the shimmery one a little bit more. Let's do them together. I like to combine them because it's just more fun. And that's what it looks like right there. So pretty. Kind of lightened up a bit, but really love this blush. I love the color. Looks super nice on the cheeks. I do have this on, so let's, let's put a little bit more. Why not? Let's touch up while we're filming. Oh, I've had this makeup on since this morning, guys. I think this is my favorite purchase out of the Ulta sale, so super excited, love this. And I've mentioned this before, I did buy the Stila Glitter and Glow Liquid Eyeshadow. This was during the sale, and this is in the color Patina. No, Perlina. Patina is their liquid lipstick. Look how bright and shiny that is but it is like highlighter for the gods right it has blue pink yellow gold like it has so many different glitter specs inside of this kind of silver base it goes with a lot of eyeshadow looks and also it blends well with the eyeshadows whatever eyeshadow you have or if you just want to wear it on its own by itself you could and it just blends so nicely on the eyes without really creasing and so really loving it all right the other items that i've hauled are from different companies let's just start with all of this overwhelming number of spawn gel <laughs> so yes i bought a lot um but my husband loves it. Some of these were bought in June, guys. That's how long ago it's been. I bought some from the Spongel website. This was bought from the BoxyCharm sale, so it was at a very affordable price. One Spongel costs around $18 to $21, I believe, depending on the style. I got one in the color Freesia Pear, and then there's one French Lavender. You guys know I have to have my lavender. I think my daughter wants this one and if you've watched my recent video where I won a giveaway I did tell you guys that this spawn gel called moonflower is going to be in my 500 subscriber giveaway so please please we're so close I hope we can get there 500 subscribers wow I mean I think I'm feeling it I think it's gonna be this month I hope I hope I don't know but this is just one out of all the items that I'm gonna be putting in a giveaway I also got this blackberry scent so I haven't really smelled this one ooh 
sweet. It has a very sweet smell. And can you see how this one doesn't have like the tie? And I actually prefer the ones that has the tie because that way it's easier to store in the shower. So if you guys haven't heard of Spongel, it's basically a sponge that is body wash and buffer. It cleanses, exfoliates, hydrates. It does everything that you need in the shower pretty much. Dermatology tested. So, ooh, I love this one. This is called Blood Orange Sorbet. This is gonna be a good one. Mm, I love this one. And then I also bought the Detox Dry Conditioner from Dry Bar. So I don't wash my hair every single day. I try this and it's weightlessly detangles, softens, and hydrates. I love leave-in conditioners, especially for my daughter's hair. I kind of bought this more for her than for me because her hair easily tangles and it's super dry. And so I like to put this on after she takes a shower. The next item that I bought are masks. Of course I had to. Um, I've never tried a mask from Proactive before. It's a detox hydrogel mask and hydrogel masks are some of the best masks the texture is like jello jelly coconut i think i'm gonna enjoy this and it's a detox mask i gotta do this because my face needs it and then the saturday skin cotton cloud mask and hint hint one of these are gonna be in a giveaway oh now i know why i bought it it says probiotic power mask nowadays when i hear the word probiotic I run and get it <laughs> and it all started with my love for the Tula cleanser I think this probiotic is genius it there's something about it that helps with plumping your skin keeping it smooth and soft and bouncy and yeah I love it so I'm curious what's in here with the probiotic I think I'm definitely gonna enjoy it and one of my subscribers will enjoy this too so please we are so close to 500 subscribers. Be on the lookout for a giveaway announcement very, very soon. Next item, Daily Concepts Detox Brush. I keep waiting for FabFitFun to put this on sale or just for me to see it in general, but basically it's a detox massaging brush. Feels very rough, but you're supposed to massage this onto your skin and it says here it stimulates circulation for me i want it for not just the massage but for exfoliation i mean take out the first layer of my skin you can have it <laughs> see these little beads that it has the little beads are soap i believe okay the next one teeth whitening charcoal powder I was so excited for this, but now I'm not so sure. When I bought this, I thought it was toothpaste, like charcoal toothpaste. We all heard of it. It's nothing new, although it's still very exciting when we hear about charcoal being a whitening ingredient because it actually turns your whole mouth black when you use it. It was powder, like powdered charcoal. And so starting my toothpaste or toothbrush with a dry product kind of made me uneasy a little bit i don't know after i used it once i feel like it had some mold in it and so i wasn't happy with that and i'm afraid to try it again a second time these four items i've hauled during a tart sale you guys know tart is very expensive right i would say the price range for tart is between 18 dollars and up this is a brow pomade i've always used a pencil brow pencil or powder on my brows but today i do have the pomade on that's what it looks like cute packaging of course we can't expect nothing less from tarte right very cute packaging right there and it looks like that i like it for the outer corners of my brows um otherwise if i put them here it gets a little too dark so i use the powder or the pencil and of course i got the tarts lights camera lashes mascara if you've seen my previous video you know this is going to be in a giveaway this one is the easy on the eyes clay liner so it's an eyeliner in gold let me show you look at the packaging right there i love it on a day-to-day -day basis you put this on and it just kind of wakes up your eyes without being too harsh
and Tarte by the Sea Concealer. Yes. Okay, I can't find it right now. But basically, it's a hydrating concealer. It's not as full coverage as I'd like it to be. But I think for 90% of you guys who don't have like, you know, designer bags like I do, you will be totally fine with the coverage. All four of these was $35. Can you believe it? It was an amazing sale by Tarte. You can't beat that. And oh, I did buy a MAC lipstick. And this is a second sneak peek. It's a full size bullet MAC lipstick. And I got this immediately because wow, this matches the color of my nails. <laughs> I think I want to keep it. And then the last thing is already in my shower. So that's why you see like the box is all beat up. It's by Living Proof. Living Proof is one of my most favorite um, hair products. I've tried like two or three of their hair products and this one is a triple detox shampoo. It removes product, pollution, hard water buildup. It cleans your scalp and that's what I like. I've tried the Briojo charcoal shampoo. I forgot the name of it. Something detox shampoo. I was trying to compare it with this one. I think I like this one a tad bit more but I don't know. What? is it with detox shampoos it can be gritty also they don't lather in your hair so it's not my favorite to use i don't know if i'm putting more product into my hair instead of actually cleaning and detoxifying it so i don't know what to feel but i'm definitely going to use it up i've only used it twice and i think i'm going to use it today because it is wash my hair day if you can't already tell <laughs> that is it guys that's all of the products that i've hauled if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i post videos once a week on skincare and beauty reviews as well as some unboxings here and there so definitely stick around there's always something to learn here on my channel and yes be on the lookout for that 500 subscriber giveaway it's coming pretty quick and fast i hope I hope um, but otherwise I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll definitely see you back in my corner soon bye